Let's run it then. All right, Juan. What's good? Welcome to another episode, Food Community yeah. Podcast. Yeah. Make homie Juan, LA Icon. So we got KP in the building. The Finessa. The Crib, man. Man, homies. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fresh out. Yeah, fresh out the bakery. You feel me? Like I never left. You feel me? Just how long were you down for, fool? Yeah, it, it was a little time. You feel me? Like a year and three months. But it was cool. Like it was a big experience. You feel me? Like I've been to county a little bit here and there, but not. What state are you from? You're from California. Yeah, I'm from California. Okay, so we're not like other places where you just go to the feds because you went to the feds. Yeah, I went to the feds. Yeah, fools. Here you go to county, you go to state, or the feds. It's not yeah. just the feds, you know. Uh, yeah. Like, yeah, I went to the feds though. It was federal prison. I know because they got state, all that shit. I know. Mm-hmm. Maybe I was, I was a. Uh, well, shit, I just you feel me? That's that case is over, shit. But I was Thank like, God. I was picking up uh, illegal immigrants and shit from the border and shit. Oh, so you're a coyote? Yeah, I was. <laughs> oh shit! You feel me? I was swiper, no swiper. You feel me on the deal? <laughs> That's fire. Yeah, how much you have to do for that? Man, it's because I already had a record and shit. So the feds works different. Oh, like, yeah. It's not like state or county food. Yeah. Depending on your life of crime. They don't give a yeah. it's been 10 years. Mm. If you have an extensive life of crime, they uh, rate it yeah, like that. I'm not sure. like, oh, well, you've been good for... Nah. Yeah. You're a criminal forever, homie. Yeah. Check this out. Hell yeah. So uh, they were just like, yeah... You know, it's your first time getting caught, you know, like if it was because usually if it's your first time, you got no record. They give you three months and you're out. You feel mm. me? So niggas, niggas that don't got record, they're like, F- it, I can f- up three or four times. <laughs> I'm saying I get out in a month or, or something before they were just taking your car. They would just pull you over, take the poils and, and, and take your car. Take, take the boils. That's rough. And, they're human. <laughs> <laughs> they're humans. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's weird, yo, I know. I'm just saying that's, 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 that's what the it's lingo, called. Bigo, you feel yeah, yeah, I feel it. That's the lingo. <laughs> that's <laughs> nasty hey, business. Yeah. How'd you get caught? Shit up. I just you know, back. I got you. They, you sent, they sent me the uh the WhatsApp. They sent me the WhatsApp, so I pulled up. I was like, damn, it was like probably like in the morning and shit. So I'll go over there. I'm like I'm like I go whatever then i pass san diego then i go i'm like these niggas want me to go they gave me a little route that i went through the border but there's no like checkpoints you feel me like a mm, oh, chopper shit. oh shit I got on live i'm like oh chopper you see me out here oh, <laughs> shit, <you> <laughs> <laughs> bro. that shit was crazy picked them up they said it was gonna be like 10 people so they're gonna give me a thousand ahead and shit so i'm like 10 bands i'm like for sure but i only picked up two nah <laughs> <laughs> oh shit yeah i only picked up two and then um i picked them up it was a dirt road turned out i went to like like it was like the sierra or something you feel me and i wasn't with my little honda court like <laughs> oh in a car not even a four by four oh that shit was crazy bro they did that shit was crazy and then i picked them niggas up and i was smoking and shit i you know oh, i was smoking them, in the whip yeah i was smoking <laughs> in the whip too you know what i'm saying so i tell them y'all want to smoke <laughs> <laughs> they're like nah nah i'm like all right for sure so we just i just left you feel me came back the hill get got back on the freeway and shit and then uh yeah they they stopped me right away it was like i guess they have like i don't know they said they saw me in the with the little like drones that are flying around and shit they see me and they're like so i'm like whatever you feel me and they just pulled me over and then i just got like that you feel me and i went to san diego i was over there mcc and shit in san diego for like mm-hmm. For like a month or so it was cool mcc san diego is cool like it, it's cool like you know what i mean like politics are different you feel me have like, you ever been to regular county jail anywhere uh yeah i've been to la county but it was like it's different you get out right away you feel me like if you don't yeah have no you big... get through processing and they let yeah, you ass out yeah. depending on what the case is but where i'm going with that is the feds mcc specifically is significantly different than la yeah, county baby yeah, yeah it is it is i was it's like, like Disneyland. i was in camp i was like in the camp like yeah this. you know what i'm saying like but yeah, it's different. I don't, I don't know too much about state, but I know that in the feds, the prices low key are like the ones, the ones. Though. You're very like uh, they always almost like you'll meet different type of prices. Like there's, you know what I'm saying? Like there's prices in South Central that you just like, oh, this price nigga right here. Like no, you meet you meet the ones in Arizona. Their prices, them niggas got sixteen tatted big peas. I'm like, then these niggas is crazy mm. too. Like you feel me? Like. But they different type of prices, like like this just border brother ass food. Yeah, border brothers. Yeah, they don't. They be some border brothers. Yep. 
<laughs> Shout out to Border Bros. These niggas don't know me, nigga. They know me. But yeah, that shit was that was a big experience. I ain't gonna lie. What's the hey, difference between the prices though? You like, are you trying to say like they're more with it, like in Arizona compared to the ones in South Central? I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. Like from my experience, they're moving a lot of money. It's a lot of money. Uh, it's really? money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know I'm saying like they on some fly shit. Like you, you're just on some fly player shit. Like you know what I mean? Like, like I talked to some of them prices, big sixteens, but they got that like. That lingo, you feel me? In their voice. They talk English. They talk English. They're Pisces, but they're like kids that are born in America or whatever. Mm-hmm. So they talk English and shit, but they're Pisces. You go in there mm-hmm. and you tell them, they'll tell you, Pisces are homie. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, I'm a crib. I'm saying they're like crib, creepo. <laughs> oh, they're like, oh, está con los negros. <laughs> we'll get to that. Go I'm ahead. Dead, oh, yeah. Hey, shout out, shout out everybody on the deal. No disrespect on it. You feel me? Uh, no, so. You're hilarious. Yeah, the deal is. But yeah, but yeah, that's. I went to the feds <laughs> and I I started tripping on niggas and shit. So they, they kicked me out of MCC and I went to San Diego, I mean, San Luis, Arizona. So when that's when I met the other type of Pisces that were in there. You feel me? They were different, different. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't gonna lie. They sent me, uh, I got moved to, uh, from MCC to uh, San Luis. Cause I was tripping and shit, and when I went over there, it was just they give you potatoes every day on the damn. It's just potatoes every day. Nobody wants to go to that facility. It's just it's bullshit. Potato at us. The call it that Ciudad de las Papas. <laughs> we were on the bus, and I was like, "Where are we going?" Some nigga was like, "La Ciudad de las Papas." Because <laughs> <laughs> he already has been there. No, vamos a ir a San Luis. He was complaining. They was complaining. I'm like, "Damn, cuz this really that bad." Yeah, it's hella bad. Food just papas every day and shit. I'm like, no, no tablets, because I'm MCC, they had tablets, mm-hmm. PlayStation, damn. <laughs> you didn't even feel like you was in jail the day. It was just like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you were just in a hotel with a gang of fools playing yeah. video games and shit. <laughs> That's a lot of damn. And some other nigga was Chinese. They were going to give him a hotel for some, I don't know, medical reasons, but he was going to go to a hotel, and, like, but he's still in jail. You feel me? Put in a hotel. Yeah, yeah, they would have been with an agent and a yeah. double bed or some shit. Yeah, mm-hmm. I said it was funny, though. Sick ass fool. So then, yeah. So you went to the feds for a little That's while, for sad. some months. That's sad. Where'd you grow up at out here, fool? Or where did you grow up, period? Well, I was born in Stockton, California and shit. And then uh, I moved from Stockton when I was 15. Here's our northerner, guys. Like I said, this is our northerner. I'm dead homies, though. But I, I, I got, <laughs> like, you feel me? Like, I, I was over there, like over there is different too. Like there's there's northerners and shit, but there's niggas that just rep their own little cliques and shit. Like you feel me? I respect it. I was just like, it's like over here, y'all got taggers, but that, that those taggers are with the shit too. You feel me? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying, but they're not. You know what I'm saying? They're not. I don't think they're gangs. They're just you know they're, they're not. I don't know. It's not I don't like know here. Too much politics about I understand. That. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. So how long did you? How long were you living up north for? Till I was fifteen. Sick. Yeah, so yeah. would you say you're? From up there, or would you say you're from down here? Because you, the rest of your life, you lived here. Yeah, the right? rest of my life, I lived here and shit. I just, I just be like, I live. I live you're Californian. I, yeah, I'm Californian. <laughs> Damn, homies, like, I got, I got the both lingos. I got both. You feel me? Like, I just, you know what I'm saying? I can like, tell by the hair, G. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> that's that. You feel me? That's that peso pluma. You feel me? Yeah, sure. <laughs> my question to you is, is um, so where did you grow up out down here? Oh. Uh, Shit, first time when I first moved there, I moved with my grandma in Maywood. You feel me? So oh, I think it was right. in Maywood. Double S. <laughs> Double S. <Yeah. laughs> so I was in Maywood and shit. I was there for a minute. You feel me? My cousin, well, because I got lighted up over there for GTA, all types of weird shit. I was always a bad kid, bro. Like, and I got like, uh, I was going to uh, see why they're going to send me see why, but my cousin, he was, he, he lives in South Central and shit. He was a bad little Sereno kid and shit. So they put him in a boot camp called 180 Recon and it changed his life and all this type of <laughs> shit. <laughs> I'm I mean, I mean, cracking up though. It's fine, me too. You're good. But like that nigga changed his life. I don't know. You feel me? Like they could tatter his face, getting them removed. You feel me? Like now he's a sergeant in the program. Like they pay him now, like to like mentor kids and shit like that. So he heard about my situation up north, and uh, he told my mom that he could help. 
Because the, the guy that ran the program was a master gunny from the Marines or some shit like that. Sick so he, ass fool. He got master juiced. gunner. <laughs> master chief halo ass fool. Well, that's like that. Go ahead. Uh, he was cool though, but they did some bunch of janky shit. I don't talk about Respect that shit. Respect to all anymore. our vets. Yeah. <laughs> but um, so yeah, them niggas went to go pick me up and shit. They said, the corp was like, oh yeah, he changed his life. Showed him my cousin and shit. Yeah, look at him. Now he's like this. And feel me? So they were like, instead of sending me COIA, they just sent me to L.A. They're like, you know, he's going to be over at the boot camp, and he don't know nobody. He can start over. You feel me? I was going to live in my grandma's house, all types of shit. So a nigga went. Ah, I'm losing my breath on the set. Damn, it's good. <laughs> I got to slow down and shit. <laughs> so you didn't go to jail for the GTA shit? No, I wasn't juvenile hall. I wasn't juvenile hall for like six months for that shit. That shit's a drag, huh? Fool? Tell me juvenile hall's not the worst place to ever do time at. I mean, shit, I, I, it was cool, like... Way like, better than county. I mean, way worse than county to me. I mean, it was cool. Like, I went there, and, and it was cool. And it was, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was cool. No program. It was just cool, you feel me? Like, guess not, you feel me? But I was just in there chilling, you feel me? Like, Where'd you go, Los Padrinos? No, I went to French camp. It's called Fresh Guy, uh, J, uh, JJC. Yeah, JJC. Mm-hmm. Justin Justice Center. But that was in Stockton, though. That was in oh, Stockton. that was up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Up, and they're going to send me to CYA. But they, my cousin lived in L.A., in South Central. Uh, that's me? how you so, ended up in Maywood. Yeah, ended up in Maywood. Makes sense. Yeah, so then okay. Up, yeah, so that's how I ended up in Maywood. And, so they changed your life, supposedly. And then I moved from Maywood to West L.A. And then I moved from West L.A. to Arcadia. And then from Arcadia, I moved to Pasadena. And then that's it. Now, you feel me? But... All, all, all my affiliations are in Florence and Normandy, though. You feel me? How? How did you not become a Pasadena Devil Lane? Blood? Nah, nah. Like, he said no. Nah. nah, but it's just like it's just like I'm like the re- how I got connected to the niggas in South Central and shit is because uh, I was my nigga. I ain't gonna lie. Shout out my nigga Man North. You feel me? Like I don't know y'all know Man North and shit. Uh, Frost, Frosty's cousin and shit. Frosty's no man's cousin and shit. Okay. So I met that nigga while Frosty was locked up and he would invite me to his house all the time. So I might I'll just pull up, pull up, pull up, kick it with them niggas. You feel me? Just so I could know the scene more. Cause you know I'm not from here, so I don't get that glimpse. You feel me? How this shit going on? You know what I'm saying? How old are you at this time? At that time I was like probably like twenty. Let's see. 23, 24, you feel me? Like, type of shit, you feel me? And, and I just started getting more to sing because I always wanted to rap and shit, you feel me? Yes. But I'm like, I'm in LA, I know that, but I need to get in contact or network with people that are in the music or get, I could get some type of, you feel me? Like, you know, you got to meet people, you feel Absolutely. me? Absolutely. It's different from hitting them in Instagram than to meeting them. When you meet them, they see your character, they see, you feel me? Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Cool, mm-hmm. cool as fuck. At the moment, I wasn't crip or nothing. I, 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 well, I got put on like four years ago, you feel me? To, you feel me? To the A-Track Gangsta Crips and shit. Over there, you feel me? I'm from the north side, Florence and Normandy. You feel me? But that's another story, you feel me? How that shit happened. But it's deep. That shit, like, I didn't look at it. A lot of people join gangs because they want to be cool and shit or whatever the fuck. I was going through shit. Like, at one point in my life, I was going through so much, and I would kick it with my nigga TNT, RP, my nigga TNT, the Jane from A Trade shit. That nigga, like, that, I was going through, like, a lot, Cuddy, you feel me? That you don't mind was, elaborating? That would help me a lot. Uh, help me a lot. Help me a lot. He was just always had my back and shit, you feel me? And, 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 and so, you feel me? Kind of joined the gang because he, like, they made me feel like family. I didn't really have family at the time, bro. There was a bunch of shit going on, you feel me? So, nigga got put on and shit, and. Niggas, niggas was there, you feel me? Type shit. Hablo Espanol? Si, si, wait. So then why the f- did you say? <laughs> so then why the f- did you say Sureño? Fool, you know how to say Sureño, way. Sureño. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the hey, shout out to Double S is on it. Yeah, homies. Oh, like, I got a bunch of homies and shit. <laughs> nah, for real. Oh, you're cool. crazy. I like you. F- it. I ain't gonna lie. Them niggas, I ain't gonna lie. Them niggas try to stab me too. Well, well duh. San Luis. Oh, out there. Yeah, bro, they try to stab me and shit. But all that shit stopped when I hit the main line. It wasn't no problem. You feel me? Like, they would just look at me funny. Because <laughs> they know that I'm with the millennials and shit. With the blacks and shit. So they look at me funny. They'll talk to me. Some of them would talk to me. The young niggas would talk to me and shit. Like, type of shit. Normal. Yeah, you feel me? Chilling. But I can, I can sense some of them. Like, the older heads... I get sense they, they were not were, pleased. They were just always looking at me like, like, <laughs> like what's up with this fool? <laughs> but there's respect over there, so they didn't know, like... No, yeah, 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 so. yeah. They would just scope y'all like yeah. this crazy-ass fool. Yeah, but 
What about what about your family and the and the whatever homies you you have in your family that are out here? How do they how do they accept the fact that Big C's Big Crippin? No, I mean, they, you feel me? They accept that shit. You feel me? Like, That's fire. Feel me like I. I, I you feel me? Like I, I, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna glorify crimes or nothing like that or nothing. Well, yeah. But I feel like I nigga always been a joint, bro. Like I always did joint shit <laughs> on a day. I'm gonna say your profile. He said a joint. <laughs> always been a joint. Hey, dude, always. Okay, look, fool. I'm an older ass fool. I'm a. I'm, I'm well, all... We can get to that too, cause I got some shit to say about that shit I'm too. I'm almost an old head. Almost. Yeah. Thank God, I'm a still i'm still looking young and hip yeah. i can lie about my age for a little while still Hell my, yeah. <laughs> my question to you is what the f- <laughs> is a joint all right look so like you feel me like <laughs> shout out to draco and sting team and all them niggas. okay so sting team originated the term kind of I, I mean i i'm not fully aware if they did or not but, but they that, popularized it the purple that i heard it from okay yeah 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 uh, but like I said, like and I've shot videos for Draco and Ralphie, well, whatever. Cool. Shout, shout out to yep. yep. So I heard that shit a long time ago. But see, mind you, that's a long time ago, like eight years ago when he dropped that bitch. I've been to Detroit. Uh-huh. Niggas after that, niggas started rapping like they were from Detroit. They forgot all about the little joint movement. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, nigga, they forgot, it, but not me. I kept saying I'm a joint. I'm a joint. You feel me? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Then that little video, the I'm a joint. You're not. You feel me? <laughs> the viral video. Huh? The viral one. Yeah, the viral one. That went on. Then everybody, oh, I'm a joy. I'm a joy. Like, hey, it's cool, though. Like, you feel me? Like, <laughs> I'm glad y'all niggas come back to your senses and shit and want to be joints and shit. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? Like, on the set, though, like, I'm really happy for that, bro. Like, niggas want to be joints again. I'm You're keeping down. the dog off on it. Yeah, damn, absolutely. Like, niggas, and so it's what like, what exactly I'm, is a damn. joint? Just a fly ass fool? Nah, just you take you take you take care of your, there's different levels of jointness, bro. Uh, tell me so I can know what level I am. All right, look, not for like there's different levels. Like if you out here, you know, take care of your family, all types of shit. Hey, you a joint, Cuddy. You a joint, mm-hmm. Cuddy. You, you doing your shit, you feel me? Yeah, if you a street nigga and you out there doing crimes, hey, cut join it up. Yeah, cut join. <laughs> you getting money, you feel me? Like you any sort, any way you any way you get money, and if you're getting a, a good amount of money, you a joint, bro. You feel me? You take care of business, you you a joint. You, just, you feel me? All, all types of joint. I got the sweaters right here. I, I got these. I just made these motherfuckers. Look, I was gonna bring you one, but I you you make my fat size fire. <laughs> Joints only department. Fire only department. They don't, you know what I mean? <laughs> like I said though, if you take care of your family, this is the clothes for you, bro. You feel me? They gotta know. You feel me? What department you in? Joints only. That's <laughs> right. When I said that, but yeah, shout out to Rock. All them niggas, they did, they be like showing love and shit. So I'll be like, that's what's up. You feel me? Oh, so they tapped in. Yeah. That's right. That was cool as shit. I'm, 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 shout out uh, Casey from the Finesse Room. The homie was one of the first niggas from Stink Team to tap in too. Like, niggas cool. Mm, that's baby. right. That was the one that came out with the the new genre, right? Three hundred four rap. Yeah, the, mm-hmm. yeah, a sixty fifth. As we say, sixty fifth and fig. Ah. <laughs> 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 me up on sixty fifth and fig. Hey, would you ever do some music like that? Yeah, I ain't gonna Type lie. Like, he gave me an idea and shit. But look, bro, like on the dead homies, bro. Like I don't like popping hot grease, like, like, like you know what I'm saying? But look, check it out, bro. On the dead homies, bro. Like I be hearing these niggas rapping shit. They cool and shit. Like I don't got that many views. On my music and I like I do like you know I got like twenty thousand or you feel me on my SoundCloud and shit. That's respectable. But in my head I hear that shit and I'm like my shit sound harder than niggas. The homies like like let me shoot my music video in the set. Let me shoot my music video in the set. That shit gonna go viral. The homies like let me I haven't shot a music video yet. But I'm like I know how to do this shit. Like once I started going viral, I something clicked in my head. That I'm like okay so this I know how to do this now. Like okay I see what I did. Now I can implement that with my music, but niggas just gotta shoot the music video. Respectfully, I'm not sure why you don't shoot music videos. That's neither here nor there. But mm-hmm. realistically speaking, as long as you got your fucking iPhone 12 and up, yeah, I think you're gonna be a okay with just doing little fucking Instagram fucking reels and you see how fools do it now with their phone. They just set it down, you, put it in cap cut or some stupid corny ta- fucking program. But I'm telling you, bro, I like before I went to jail. Before I went to jail, I was doing all, bro. Oh, that's right. You're just fresh out. The ass, I didn't go to work, nothing, bro. Not the public grease. I was just 
getting money, like, just in the streets, bro. Like, dead homies, like, so I felt like a joint when I said, I'm a joint here now. Like, I, really, I got <laughs> all really the fly clothes. I got all yeah. that shit. I'm going to work. You feel me? Like, I, bro, you feel me? Oh, they call that nigga Mr. Phoenix Flex, and he, uh, I met that nigga once and shit. Uh, with that nigga FB, he produced beats for him. He took me over there. I don't there want to be in Phoenix. He, cool. He took me over there. That nigga know me. Go crazy, tell the KP or Walt Carter. They know me, nigga. You feel me? I got a whole backstory with FB, but we're not gonna talk about that. You feel me? But shout out that nigga too. You feel me? Yeah. I said, but uh, that nigga was like, uh, cause I got, I was busting out ridiculous more than the rappers on the day. <laughs> <laughs> Understand I would pull up On a day homies like, like Not to say this You feel me But That nigga FB Would invite me places right And we pull up And they didn't know who How FB looked You feel me They didn't know how that nigga they looked They thought you were him They thought I was him <laughs> <laughs> I was bust out Ridiculous Fly clothes Like Hey you FB I'm like Nah that's this nigga You feel me <laughs> <laughs> you just got, That nigga was like you, This nigga got on For no reason <laughs> Mr. No, Mr. Got it on for no reason. You feel me, type shit. But it's another story. You feel me? But like I said, I, I, I about manifesting and shit. I know what the fuck I was doing until I went to prison. I read the book, The Secret. You ever read The, yes. the Secret? So when I read the book, I was like, damn. So that's what I was doing. Crazy, boy. <laughs> so now that I'm out, I've been manifesting on gang shit. You feel me? Like, like I like it's just it's different, bro. Like I don't know how to explain that shit, but. I know, like when I tell you, I'm about to blow up with that music shit. I'm my mama, like I know it, I believe it. Like you feel me? Like it's it's like I'm not even lying to myself. I can't lie to myself because I really feel it. Like I already know, I visualize it when I do it. When I drop the music video with the homies in the set, you feel me? Like it's gonna be, and I know how to market now. I know how to market. You feel me? Like that's the thing I didn't know before. How to market music or how to run an ad? You feel me? Cause I'm a street nigga, bro. I don't know how to do that shit or run an ad and shit like. But now I know, you feel me? Like, so I was like, and I and I started getting bread now. Now I got to, you know, slow bread is better than no bread. You feel me? Facts. I'm, I'm, I'm working now, you feel me? Because I'm for probation. I got to work and, and shit like that. But I'm like, fuck it. Like, I'm blessed right now. You feel me? I got a place where I don't play. I got a place where I stay. They don't charge me rent. You feel me? They Fire. Just, so I'm just, you feel the me? The halfway house. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the halfway house. <laughs> hey, 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 bro, you want to pass right now. I want to pass right now. Just say it. You're down as <laughs> full fuck. Uh, yeah. Sick. Yeah. So damn. I get it. We're joints. We're joints and they join it up. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> join it up to the max max. Keep it relaxed. Like, feel me? Hey, did you expect that video to go viral or not? I'm well, joining or not. Some, well, I just posted that video like I was in my story. I didn't post that as a post. You feel me? Mm. It just went crazy. It just went on my homie's side and he thought it was funny and shit because he knows me. He, he like could really connected more than me in there. Yes. So when he posted, people, other people from the set that knew me they thought it was funny. And it mm. just, just went crazy, yo. Because they knew that. Oh, that nigga KB's crazy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it went viral on Twitter. Uh, Ham Wap, I think his name is. He's one of the niggas that shared it. Got two hundred thousand views, and then I'm like, damn, that video did good. I was like, let me let me post that video somewhere else. Let me see how it does. Post it somewhere else. I'm like, ooh, I shit did good there too. And I got hella followers on crib. I'm like, okay, let me go <laughs> take here. Boom, 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 boom. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna just promote the shit of this video. I know it does good. You feel mm -hmm. me? So nigga just been promoting that video and shit, and then people will see what else I got or whatever the fuck, you feel me? But if you don't mind me asking, without incriminating yourself or anybody, how the fuck did you get into human trafficking, big dog? <laughs> oh shit! Because <clears throat> I tell you, I was like, and I'm trying to incriminate myself, but I was doing the gang of shit, bro. You feel me? Before I got locked up, you feel me? And, and allegedly, of course. Allegedly, and shit. You feel me? But I ain't gonna lie. I can tell you this, like. I don't condone stealing, and I never stole from no homie. Like, if you bring me to your house, I don't steal. I steal from the stores. You feel me? Like, and I, I don't give a f You feel me? Because yeah, it's a store. I, whatever. I just save my money. You know what I'm saying? So I used to go to... I, these these cases are all over this shit. You feel me? I used to go to Beverly Hills, Neiman Marcus, Saks Fifth, go in there, look at some nice, go to the fitting room, put it on, come back out. And, oh, it didn't fit. And just leave the store. You feel me? And that nigga got hella fits doing that shit. Because <laughs> I got caught. Beverly Hills, I got locked up for Neiman Marcus. I got caught for like three sweaters. A, a Givenchy sweater, a Burberry jacket, and a, another Givenchy sweater. But each sweater was like 1200 You feel me? <laughs> but on the damn, when I used to pass, when I wouldn't get, you know, I'll put it on. I'm like, 
That's all I gotta say. I'm be like this. Jesus. They go to the studio, make a song. I'm flying the bitch. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm flying the bitch. I'm like, they can say it. You feel me? You feel me? I'm a nigga bitch. You fucking give a dick. You know what I'm saying? So. That's the thing I also learned about making music. That it's about a feeling. Hell yeah. You gotta put a feeling in that motherfucker. Like when I said those things, I hear some of my music, I'm like, that nigga not lying. <laughs> I'm not laughing. My music is character at all. My music is not. If you hear my music, I sound like a character, but it sounds hard. Like it's just. Uh, uh, you feel me? I'm just. It's different. You feel me? But go check it out. Spotify, all that shit. You feel me? Like you'll hear it. But. But yeah, bro, like, nigga was just, although he well, making shit, I, I get out of, for me to start talking about some other shit that I be doing and shit. <laughs> that shit, uh, I put on Instagram, who got, who got motion, who got motion, like, what's up? Like, I need more motion, you know? Somebody hit me up. Some nigga, you, you know? Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that nigga said, pull up. I said, all right. So nigga pulled up. And the first time I pulled up, them niggas, that nigga fell asleep or something. And I was just there waiting. I'm I'm leaving. The second time he pulled up, I, I went, and that's when I got caught. I only did that once, and we got caught. Oh, shit. Yeah, and the damn homies. I was mad. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, and the damn homies. It's cool, though. Damn, that's crazy. Yep. So, music-wise, um, who do you got songs with and shit like that? Who have you worked with? Who I got songs with? I don't really got songs with nobody. I just mad North or like you feel me? Cause I don't pay for features or anything like that. But I respect you it. can see me in Frosty's Fresh Out, was Fresh Out video I was in that month. Yeah. You can see me in Phoenix Flexing Nerd Dark Square I was in that month. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, I made beats too. I made a beat for Frosty. He dropped it. That's cool. I made uh, what else to do? Yeah, bro. Like you feel me? I just. Be getting money and just staying out the way, you feel me? But they know me on Crip. All them no, niggas yeah, know they me. know you. On the day home, they know me, bro. Like, and shout out them niggas, bro. Shout out all them niggas, but they know me, bro. You feel me? They, they know I'm the joint. So I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> that's right. I just said, like, what should we expect from you this 2024 now that you're out and you're moving around and shit? Damn, bro, I'm telling you right now, bro. Damn, I'm not 20, 20, 20, 24th, February 24th. On Some the, shit. And damn homies, bro. You gonna see, bro. You gonna be like, damn, that nigga KP. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and nigga, hey, dead homies, though. But shout out everybody doing their shit, bro. I see, like, you feel me? The Rasa is doing, a, uh, like, you know, music-wise, you feel me? Like, I knew a long time ago, I'm like, that shit's gonna happen. Like, it's gonna, it's gonna eventually, nah, you feel me? Shout out all the homies and everybody doing it. But it, it, I see a lot of more demographic in that rap community place right now. You feel me? Like, and that's good, you feel me? Like, it's just, you know, a lot of people get slandered because niggas use the N-word or whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying? Like, or they, you know what I'm saying? But it's just, that's the lingo, you feel me? Like, it ain't no disrespect or nothing for people that don't understand that, you feel me? In most cases, I would ask you, why do you say that? Not that I'm against it super yeah. totally, but, you know, I'd ask for the people that are, just to fuck around. Yeah, it's but, just uh, like people like... Like, you're cripping, so it's kind of different, you no, know what I'm saying? I feel you, but I would, like, before I be in Maywood, the niggas would call me dick. They were like, what's up, dick? And I would like, what the fuck is it? What the fuck is it? So it's like saying, what's up, my nigga? You feel me? But that's that area. You feel me? That area. Well, I'm from East LA, and you know we say dick, too. What's you know up, what I'm saying? That's how I talk, like, yeah, literally. No, I know, I know. And I'm other saying. people from other areas will talk to me like that yeah. on purpose to no. fuck around with me. Like, what's up, I'm, dick? No, I know. I hear you, but that's, that's the lingo. It's like, it's like for people that don't know and they see on TV, they're like, hey, they're like, why are them niggas talking about dick? You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like me, when I say the M word, they're like, why is he saying it? Because that's how I grew up. Like, niggas saying left and right. That's all I hear over there. You feel me? I feel it. So it's just not that I'm trying to fit in. It's just, it's like. It's just what it is. It's just the accent, I think. You feel me? Like, an accent type shit. You feel me? I feel it. Yeah, yeah. So if you were to get features and you didn't have to pay for them joints, who would be some features that you would want to fuck with? <clears throat> Mm, I don't know. I don't, I don't really like these niggas. Man. <laughs> 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 nah, like, oh, no, cool. you like what they said, look, like, just, you know, they they cool and shit. Like, it's just, uh, let me see, let me see, who, who? A long time ago, no cap, I was supposed to do a song with uh, R3 Man, the Chili Man. R3 Man, 
FB and one of his homies were gonna set that up because I was going viral for that. I'm a joint, you're not. And he heard some of my music. I guess he was like, oh, look, tell nigga to do a song with cause. And then uh, I got locked up. But then when I got out, I saw that he made a little tape called Joints Only. I'm like, when I got, I'm like, so I guess I inspired that nigga because that's what I was calling that shit back then. Joints Only, Joints Only. In the video, I don't know if y'all seen another video when I'm like. I don't gotta talk to a lot of you niggas. I'm gonna start acting like a real joint around here. <laughs> <laughs> and in the back, I have wrote Joy Tolly. You feel me? That's right. But yeah, shout out to R3 Chili Man. It's cool, bro. I'm glad everybody wants to be joints again. Like I said, you feel me? Like, it's cool with me. You feel me? So right. it's safe to say you kind of brought that back then? That's what I'm trying to say. I'm not trying, you know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't say it. I didn't say it. You heard your man. You feel me? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, like, you feel me? Like, because on the set, like, when I was in the set of shit, niggas would, they were like, bro, you don't understand how, huh? like, you the joint, huh? I'm like, what are you talking about? Like, people that don't know Dr- uh, Draco or shit like that, when they saw the video, they think you made that shit up. So they're like, they, 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 when, they, when people hear the word joint, I don't know. Maybe not you guys. You feel me? It's but funny. over there in the set, the homie who told me like this. When people hear the word joint, they don't think of Drake no more. They think of, I'm going to tell you not. Because mm. like, that was that last little version of that shit. It'd be me? like that. So I was like, damn, that's crazy. I'm well, like, that's tight. Yeah, that's tight. But niggas be hating, Cuddy. Like, you feel me? Like, I mean, you're still giving it up to the stinks for fun. Yeah, you don't yeah, put it, yeah. You want shit. Yeah, hell yeah, I'm, I'm crit, but niggas be hating though. You feel me? Like I, I gotta move smarter. You feel me? Before I used to wear a face mask everywhere I went because now I'm a famous crit, low key. You feel me? Well, in the LA area, where you feel me? Where everybody around there, like they seen that I'm a joint. No, you're not. Video. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I go to slots and miles. Niggas recognize me. Oh, but you're not. But you're not. I'm like, damn, dead homies. And I'm not trying to talk. You feel me? Shit, but you feel me? I got enemies and shit. So them niggas gonna see me. I I, I think some niggas, some of them niggas see me, and they were like, I'm like, oh, them niggas right there. Oh, it's cuz. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, so I gotta move a little bit smarter and shit. You feel me? And right now, you feel like before I used to be wearing a blower all day. You feel me? Feeling safe and shit. And I'm not. You know, I'm not saying anything right now, but like, it's different now. Like they got federal case. Federal probation. Yeah, like it's shit different. Like so. Feeling like parole. Federal probation is significantly different. Yeah, yeah. My- really do their time all, all like 80 like, percent you know i'm saying like they don't do that 50 percent or whatever now uh, you're doing all that yeah, mostly yeah. yeah but i mean yeah, yeah how much are you familiar with the latin rap scene you latin rap scene yeah I, y'all be you know what i'm saying I be, who you fucking with i'm not gonna ask you for your top five all time like i usually well, do oh well, like like what do you mean latin like right now in the scene in, in la yep all right let me see like like anybody or just are you talking about Hispanics and shit? Hispanic, okay, okay. Latin. I'm gonna see. Um, let's see. I'm gonna see. Um, I guess that that, that nigga ain't gonna lie. That nigga hard. I heard one of his songs. I'm like that nigga. Ooh. Look, that nigga. What's that name? Your name? Rowdy Racks or some shit like that. Rowdy Racks is hard as that little like old school B he did that dun 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 I'm like and then I heard him. I'm like that shit hard. Damn. Oh yeah 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 yeah. He did that shit. He's smart. Uh, the- the, 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 for fuck's sake, that one, right? I, yeah, forget yeah. What, I forget what it's called. You did it in your little show. Oh, yeah. Why gotta be little now? Nah. Who's be talking like that? <laughs> Don't worry. I know. I know. I be talking like that too. I just wanted to. <laughs> down. They always, they always be like, why he saying little show? So I just had to get that out the way. <laughs> nah, the big show is the big show. It was good. It was good. It was a great show. Who cool, cares? It was cool, a little show. Cool. Hey, nah, that's cool. That's, you know. It was our first show. It, it's Fire. Just, hell yeah. Like, Were you I respect there, that. Or you nah, go? I wasn't there. I wasn't there. But you know I, mean? I wanted to be there. Like, on the day home, was like, I'll, I'll be over there. And I'll be like, damn, bro, I'll be losing a gang of opportunities. Like, I could be out there. I know hella people. I could have been gave this nigga frosty a sweater. I could have been, you know what I'm saying? I know these niggas. I could just go, hey, put this shit on. You feel me? Like, no disrespect. Yeah, yeah. I'll bleep it. Don't shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You, you feel me? So, like, but, <laughs> hey, God's plan. You feel me? God, I'm over there stacking up money. You feel me? So, please don't waste this interview, fool. On the day, homie. No, we won't waste it. Because people are going to see it. I already got like three righteous clips in my mind that are going to go all the way up. Oh, please yeah. capitalize. Go, you feel me? Like, Fat Joe, we go all the way up. On mm-hmm. whatever. Shit happens from these clips because it's gonna yeah. be viral, fool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and, and yeah, yeah, it's gonna go viral. You feel the me? The boil one, the boil one, that's going up. That's going up. That's going crazy. They're gonna be like, that's the, human the human, 
bro. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I wanted to show like that. I, if I would have passed, I mean, it would have been two bands or whatever, but I would have been like this. Like, yeah. So look, It'll... that gesture right there, I have a pal of mine that may not be your pal, but he's a pal one, of mine. This one right here? Yeah. Uh, I see Almighty Suspect doing that shit, but I know that that fool used to Shout be Shout out Almighty with... Suspect. I'm not going to lie. Rafi was the first one I seen do that. Oh, do the little move yeah. like that? Okay, cool. All right. Let's see. Whatever. Yeah, maybe, I guess. What side is that? Like, who? What's what section does that? Is that just some South Central not shit? To be honest, bro, that shit just, like... It's just, uh, the, way just, shit. just, just the way you did it. That's just It's just the way you did it was very... Like, they do this too. They put their feet like this. You know it's just mean? some pimp shit, I like think. This. But okay, see, yeah, this yeah. is even a, a game banging stance. You yeah, know? it is. It's like it's just. A, you know what I'm saying? My like, boys back in May was a double eight. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like they, you know what I'm saying? Like. I don't know who started that shit, but like you feel me? But hey, just because I see suspect, because well, I don't follow a lot of people on the internet, but suspect. that was one of my co-hosts at No Jumper, because yeah. I be up there too and shit. And I see him do it. I'm like, why does he do that stupid shit? <laughs> Because he feels join it up. Yeah, yeah, join yeah, it up. Yeah, you go like yeah. this. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you thought he was having a seizure or something? No, no that was cool as shit. <laughs> Shout out that nigga. Shut up. Nah, yeah, you know, obviously, no people that fuck with uh, the snowest gerbist. Yeah, shout out Snow Gerb. Like Gerb. Dude. Nah, yeah, he'd be doing something similar as well. Something yeah, like, he, okay. He'd he be spazzing out and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just right here. Shout out everybody doing their shit. Shout out Roddy Rags. Shout out, uh, what's the other nigga name? He hard too. He cool. Left? Left the gunplay. Yeah, that nigga hard too. That nigga hard. Uh, that nigga, Phoenix Racing hard. You know, he he hard. You feel me? That nigga old Jeezy doing his thing. Yeah, they reunited. It feels yeah. so good. Yeah, hey, shout out. <laughs> So, hey, some other nigga, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna say this, cutie, I don't give a fuck. I ain't no hating ass nigga, like, you feel me? Some niggas get, would get on here and won't even say my name, even though they know I'm I'm the joint, you feel me? Like, just to be on some hater shit, you feel me? But, <laughs> like, shout out that nigga, uh, what's his name? Doughboy? Doughboy? Uh, but I'm talking about some other, not Doughboy 909, some other nigga. Official? No, Doughboy, that, uh, from BSB, um, something. Oh, from the Dino. Yeah, from the Dino. Yeah, yeah. You know, talking about all tied up nigga. Yeah, like, nigga talking about. Yeah, that nigga hard. That nigga don't get a lot of, feel me? Like, nigga hard. That's, That's tight. I'm not sure I know who you're talking about, but I feel it. He That's was posted tight. today. I'll check it out. Yeah, yeah, he hard as shit, you feel me? I feel like, he, <clears throat> I'm, I'm going to keep it real. He one of the hardest niggas in San Diego. I mean, San Diego and San Bernardino. And, and, and you feel me? He harder than certain niggas, but he just don't got that money. That's because you got to understand. You could be hard as f but you need that money. You know what I'm saying? You need that money, like, hey. That's very valid, fool. You need that money, bro. Because there's niggas that are trash. I think a lot of, some, like, I know just spray Cardi B. I love you, Cardi B. <laughs> Your music, trash. I, to me, to me, at least to me. Like, you feel me? Like Her production just, is crazy, I though. I just like her on features. When she's on features, they knock she it down. be spazzing. You know, she be spazzing. But it was her song. I don't like it. I, mean, I, I like how sexy Red sounds. She got character in her voice. It's just like, it, it's just different. Like, you can really feel it. You feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? But shout out Cardi B and shit and, and Nicki Minaj. You feel me? <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, one more time. Like, damn, how many young? Look, I'm going to keep it real. Look, you know who, uh, what's her name? Is? She bad. Uh, so, oh, so Jade, Jade. Jade, you never heard of Jade? Who? Jade. Yo, soy Jade. Yo, soy Jade? Yeah, you know her? You looking talking, like Juan looking like hmm. No. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Isn't that oh so Jade? Yeah, he did. She did that one nigga. Six nines X. Yeah, bitch, bad. I got her on my vision board. <laughs> I'm trying to better fast step, better fast step, bitch. Oh, the one after his baby's mama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that yeah. girl. Yeah, she's pretty. Yeah, she's bad. Like, she's she bad. Me laugh. Up. Like it, she got that face when I look at her. It just makes me laugh. Like, and I like you. Like. You're cool. <laughs> Not because she got ass or titties. Yeah, she's beautiful, but her little her little smile just be. I be like, this bitch funny. Damn, I'm like, I like funny bitches. I like it. <laughs> I, like, I like funny bitches and bitches that like me. They're homies. Because those bitches do more for you than the you like. Cause <laughs> the bitches you like, you got to pay for days. The bitches you like, you know what I'm saying? You got to go on and be on. You feel me? The like you, that could be toxic. You, yeah. know? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. I still don't like you. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, that's all I gotta say. You feel me? Just go look at my music and shit. And like I said, 
I don't know, cap on a day, how much on the next nigga up on the music shit. Let me just, I'm just stacking up my money right now. You gotta get your money right, you feel me? You gotta come, get, come I'm, any of, look, look, give me y'all advice. If y'all rappers, y'all can believe me or not, I don't give a f. I, I ain't no hating ass nigga, I'll give you the sauce, you feel me? You gotta have money, you gotta have a video or whatever the f. You know, this video does views, go promote that shit, go test that shit out somewhere else. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? You gonna get your followers up, you feel me? And, I like that. So I hit at the food community for a week. Okay, let's take this shit somewhere else and see what to do somewhere else real quick. Dead homies, yeah. And it like, just stays active and active and active. Yeah, like I, before I, like I got that. to that new West West Coast page. I don't know y'all. You know what I'm talking about the new music. I think I'm West. familiar. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before I got there, I already had then it dropped that video at like 20 other pages. But when I got there, I'm gonna did two million views, a hundred thousand likes and shit. You know what I'm saying like. And it hit. And it, 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 it hit. It hit. Yeah, that video got. Like over like all combined, probably like four or five million views. That's yeah. great. That's yeah, your ass cannot go to the swamp meet, my boy. I mean, damn, huh? Why not? Well, because they're gonna be spotted. Spot them, got them. They ain't gonna spot me. They spot me more like I ain't gonna be like no, like you feel me? Like no, it's no disrespect, but they spot me more with like where more African Americans are. They 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 spot me there. Damn, you know what I'm saying? Well, because you're a crip. It's that joint shit. I'm a joint. You're not. I was like, damn. You caught me. You caught me. But see, I gotta be careful because like, damn, these niggas will shoot you, bro. Like niggas will shoot you it's just on some hater shit, on some weird shit. But it's cool. I understand. I, you feel me? I, I'm from A Trey. We don't get around. With, we don't get along with you. Feel me? The, 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 the oh. you know what I'm saying? We don't get along with them niggas. But I got homies from there. Relax. You know what I'm saying? Those your homies. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying though? Like I try to keep it respectful and shit, but you feel me? Sometimes you feel me? It just a lot of shit be going on. You feel me? Like a nigga done been shot. Niggas done shot me a bunch of times and shit. Like you feel me? You been shot a gang of times? Yeah. When I started king, I went man north. Niggas started getting shot every day. You feel me? That's what I'm like, man, it's crazy. Have you been shot? I you get oh, shot. No, at. I never got shot. So you like, been shot at? I've been shot at. Yeah. That's and drag. Range, range, close range. It's a music video on YouTube too. You can see the whole shooting. Damn homies. Everybody they taped up the whole scene. Like when you look at the music video, you, you be thinking, ah, oh, these niggas pay for the cops and the, and the yellow tape. These niggas, <laughs> the whole production and shit. Nah, like, that was a real scene. And he, his whole mama house got shot up. I'm cripping. I was right in the front. These niggas pulled up like four four guns. It was like a, a shotgun, like a little uh, AR, like a pistol. And, and I think, I don't know what the, fuck the other one was, but they, oh, nigga, I nigga was running. I was I'm about to die. They shot the homie. The homie got shot. But it was just a fragment of a bullet that hit him. You feel me? They weren't trying to kill nobody. I ain't going to lie. Because they were too close to us, bro. Everyone should have died if an AR was on the scene. Everyone died. You feel me? Like, I was and a shoddy close ranger someone's whole world up. over the gate you know like you know how you, 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 you like you said so how far Juan is to right here yep yeah fool. Yeah, there's I'm no way a shotgun is gonna miss yeah god was on my side oh, right there to right there the shotgun spray the the spray is like yeah. as big as this logo I'm that's a human body that's you know what i'm saying logo. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you yeah. here, baby? You made it. <laughs> yeah, we made it. We're over here, bro. Shout out the full community, bro. And, and, and shout out everybody doing their shit. Shout out No Jumper. Shout out the niggas. You feel what the fuck? These niggas, you feel me? I don't even want a No Jumper interview, to be honest. Why, fool? Because, bro. It's just for what? <laughs> I'm at the full community. Dead homies. You know I, mean? I, <laughs> I respect it. That fool loves that shit. He's like, yeah, yeah. Adam, we don't need you, Adam 22. You heard it. You heard it from the joint, bro. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to go to your store. Dead homies. I was just there, fool. That's the homie. <laughs> <laughs> He they hate they hate that I fuck with that fool. He co-signing this. They always yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, nah, you Adam 22. You feel me? And I'm gonna keep doing my shit or whatever. Me like I know niggas that I'm gonna tell you this right now. No, uh, I know if I meet no, that nigga Adam Twenty Two, he'll give me an interview. I just be like, what's up, nigga? Like, what's good, bro? We'll, we'll, I'll just chop it up with him first. You feel me? Cause there be niggas, no disrespect to some of these niggas. I'm not gonna say no names. These niggas only got six hundred views. I'm like, this nigga got an interview. Oh, f this nigga, this nigga second. Oh, like, you know what I'm saying like. I'm moving crib like but it's good though. Like I'm just gonna build my like I said, I'm gonna build more of my shit. That's gonna happen. You feel me? Like. I want a Vlad interview. You feel me? That's what I want. That's crazy. A Vlad interview or whatever. He gonna question the f out of you. It ain't gonna be like this. <laughs> yeah, he can question the f out of me. I'm be like, next question. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Vlad though. So, yeah. what was it like when you? F yeah, Vlad's something else. So. What? He's he's a unique interviewer. 
Mm. Vlad, he on some deep, deep dive shit. Yeah, he is not. He'll he'll really do whatever the f- uh, incriminate you on. <laughs> I don't know. Nah. I don't really watch Vlad interviews, but he is the legend. Hey, what's up with the? So, what y'all niggas think about Crip Man? Well, I know you don't like him because he's from neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah but like, <laughs> for me, be laughing at that nigga like, yeah, cut hella funny, cut funny. He's cool. You know what I'm saying like, I've been around him quite a bit. I've conversed with him quite a bit, and he's cool. He's cool, huh? That will be popping out to our charity event. That nigga shared one of my videos. Huh? He shared one of my videos on his on his Instagram story. That's love. Yeah, that's so I'm like, he cool. Cause it's cool. Cause Join cool. cause it's cool, hood. I could imagine him saying yeah, shit. Where Swamp Stories exposed, cause. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't seen that swap story? Uh, my wife interviewed him, but, and he said about his whole life story where yeah, he like, lived. That's what I'm saying. Cut trying to expose, cut like expose him from what he from 55th Street. If every like respectfully he, he go to his home, oh. like you feel me? Cut really from there. It don't matter he wasn't born there. It don't matter if cut. You feel me? No, yeah, he, he went to there. Texas. He went to wherever he was. He was with his mom. What he's supposed yeah. to do? He's a little last kid. Uh, Your ass came from Stockton at 14. Swamp stories. When I see you, damn. <laughs> no, but like Swamp stories is going up. Shout out to them. Yeah, shout out to them, bro. Not janky. But yeah. Why why what do you think about Crib Mac? Crib Mac, funny as hell, I ain't gonna lie. When he I was thought you were gonna try to take shots. Nah, but that nigga funny as hell when he was at the plug talk with Lena. Oh, that shit's hilarious. He, that shit. he was trying to fuck her and shit. He was like He was really trying to win. He was almost winning. He was almost winning. Lena probably told that nigga Adam, you gotta be fucked up, nigga. <laughs> 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 Oh, the damn, he was like, "What? Just let him, let him get to the finals. Just let him get to the finals. It's gonna be, it's gonna be, a, lot of, it's gonna be a lot of views. Don't trust me. Trust me. You no, know, Cuddy liked the views. He's smart though. You feel me? I watched that shit. I was like, damn it. I didn't watch it, but that's that shit's hilarious. That shit was hilarious. I mean, let the dude win, right? Like star dude. That nigga little. Damn. That nigga little was over there, happy as." Jumping around and shit. I don't even know. I don't even know why he won. Um, I don't. I didn't watch, so I don't know. But Crip Mac should have won. My oh, homie, Crip my Mac. homie Smokes was like, he saw the cast. He was like, Little D's gonna win and watch. And I was like, Who the fuck is Little D? He was like, That fool. Couple weeks oh, later, yeah, he won. Yeah, he won. He was like, Yeah, the reason why he won is because he's the real porn star. What the fuck? Yeah, that, that nigga was the real porn star and shit. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna say nothing. But yeah, that nigga really punched I don't know. You heard about Adam, what he be doing and shit? What? He like trans. No. He let that one bitch sit in his lap. Y'all seen that shit? Oh, shit. I think he shit. just be trolling really hard, That's though. Funny. He would f her, though. Kirby would. The way he was looking like when she sat on him, he, he liked that shit. Man. That shit's kind of crazy to yeah. me. I got, I, got my, I got a good, uh, I can sense that shit. You Gator? Me? Like it says, all that shit. Like, I, <laughs> like, stay away from me, nigga. I already know. <laughs> he did a little certain walk. Oh, yeah, stay away from me, nigga. That's crazy. Yeah, he looked at me funny. Adam's yeah. taken down a lot, a lot of girls. Who I don't know. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. You got money, you can take down a lot of girls, bro. I seen the most ugliest nigga. F- hella b- you go to, you go, look, you go to, this nigga's in here, like, don't get no. That go to Colombia or or, or be the man, be or Beijing or whatever the fuck. Beijing. They get there, they're tens now. They turn into tens because they're America. Uh, of course, mm-hmm. Femi, come on, Mister America. Exactly, but see them niggas can't come over here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, you got money. Okay, your bitch took by a joint. You, yeah, your bitch gonna get taken by me with a bike. <laughs> <laughs> I can't drive right now. I got no license right now. They took my license, bro. And the damn used to ride around all over LA, everywhere, bro. Just when there's traffic on the, the freeway, I used to go on the, you know, where you had to pull over on the, the shoulder. Side? I just go all the way, all the way, all the way. With the hazards on, G. Yeah, with the hazards on too. I just be all the way, just a little 20, and smoking too. 25 miles per hour. Everybody be safe. Got, everybody get in the car with me. Nigga, you crazy. Nigga, you crazy. I'm like, nigga, relax, bro. Relax. We, we, we join it up. We join it up. Right <laughs> now. This is the first place lane. I used to tell them this is the presidential lane. Oh, you can only be on this lane if you were joined, Cuddy. So relax. <laughs> you, this is a privilege for you to be here. <laughs> Man, let's relax. <laughs> blowing, going down the 110. Just, I'm oh, like, this I, is I, I'll be like, I never heard of traffic, bro. Niggas talking about LA, there's traffic. I'm like, never heard of that shit. <laughs> <laughs> he got the new fast track. I never heard of that. The shit. joint track. Mm, AKA the shoulder. <laughs> yeah, bro, bro. 
A lot of people know about that lane. Some people do. Some people I around occasionally, depending on how anxiety out I feel in traffic. Yeah, that nigga. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. The first person that sh- uh, I ain't gonna lie, cause before when I met Frosty the Snowman, I-, I wasn't driving like too crazy. You feel me? But um, when I used to pull up with them niggas, we used to follow Frosty. It used to be like five cars following this nigga, cause we were good, gonna go do shit or meet yeah, people yeah, or whatever yeah, the yeah, fuck. Yeah. So we used to go with that nigga. That nigga used to smash though. Like smash past every red light, so you had to like be right behind him, so or he's gonna just get off on you. You feel me? And then kind of take forever to answer the phone, all types of weird shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So the every you'll just see like five cars. It looked like we were racing and shit. Like, <laughs> and then a nigga got used to driving like that, and I just kept driving like that everywhere. It's just more convenient. You feel me? And shit like <clears throat> type of shit. You feel me? I got hella tickets though. Feel me? <laughs> and the fast track too, I got hella tickets. That's why I can't get my license and shit. But I'll get it next year on February and shit. But I'm gonna be, you feel me? I was driving, I ain't gonna lie, I got no license. I'm incriminating myself, but nigga was driving, you feel me? It gives me, when I come back and I start driving, I'm like, damn, I'm like, I'll get activated. You feel me? I haven't been activated. I've been over there hibernating. <laughs> so they come here, get activated. Feel me? Like, <laughs> I feel it. What you got for the homie back there, Buckaroo? Shit, what, what's the next viral clip? The next viral clip, like I said, bro, just... He has a few coming from the food community, I'll tell you that. <laughs> we got at least two. Yeah, we got some funny ones, you feel me? And, uh, just to be honest, bro, I'm just a joint, bro, and the damn, bro, like, shout out my sets out, h track against the crib, you already know, nigga, you feel me, the north side. The RP, my nigga, TNT, the giant, that shit really hurt, bro, and the damn. Man. Rest in peace. That nigga, that nigga, you, you would have met that nigga, you would have loved that nigga, and the damn, he just, like... Like, like, from the damn, like, he just, you feel me? Like, I never glorify no nigga. And then homie's like, because you're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to be like, oh, like, nah, but Kev was just a real ass nigga, bro. Like, you feel me? The real nigga shit, like, like you feel me? So RP my nigga, though. That shit hurt, though. But, you know, life is life. You feel me? I feel like I lost two people that year. You feel me? So, like, and RP my nigga Black Boy. Y'all remember Black Boy? Yep. That was really my little homie. And then homie, he wasn't from my Saturday, but... He would always keep boy. Up. He was my boy and shit. I mean, it's, you know, you, clout, clout, bro, is a dangerous drug. And niggas go after, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, let's with that nigga GBO Gaston. Y'all, y'all know that nigga? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Cud, Duno. You feel me? What he did to, what's that nigga name? 1900 or something? Sad. Wait, what he, he do? He went to his sad and shit. He was like, oh, shit. Right here. Right here. <laughs> I'm like, damn, it's Cud going, you know what I'm saying? Like, you didn't see the video where he disrespected the the naps and shit? Damn, he disrespects he disrespects a lot of people. Yeah, but bro, I'll be like, why? I mean, no no offense, you feel me? I'm like, I don't know, he's untouchable, I guess. I don't know, you feel me? Like, mm-hmm. He be kicking it with some of the homies and shit though, like. But that nigga, you feel me? Yeah, I, I thought y'all knew about that nigga, but yeah, yeah no, I know about him. He be doing this little shit. I ain't gonna lie. Like, you feel me? Even though they, they caught that nigga one time. I think they beat his ass, though. Oh, no and, shit. And he stopped doing that shit. Some nigga went up to him. No, they beat his ass. And then some other nigga went up to him. Why are you disrespecting Nipsey? Oh, because I just wanted attention. <laughs> nah. That's crazy. Yeah, crypto, but... It is what it is, though. You feel me? Niggas trying to market. As you understand, a lot of people don't got money. So when they figure a little marketing way to do it, they're like, I'm going to just do this and, and hope I don't get killed. And then I'll just apologize later. Feel me? Mm. Like, you seen that one nigga that disrespected El Chopper in the cartels? The, the oh, street. shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like that nigga. You feel me? I don't know if they gonna kill that nigga. But, uh, did he apologize already? I don't think that matters. Yeah, uh, he exactly. But see, but did he? Did he? Yeah, he apologized. He did, huh? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. But see, he got all that attention, though, first. I promise you the, the disc got way more attention than the apology. No, hell yeah. And that shit gonna, you feel me, Go probably get, most likely get dealt with. You feel me? But Most but, uh, likely. Niggas want clout. So if that who tries to ever go vacation in Mexico, he is yeah, he popping it. You feel me? Them niggas not playing. Man. Shout out to Pisces again, like I said. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Pisces. Talk to me about the Walk Harder shit. How did that come about? Oh, damn. I'm just like... Because I never made beats or nothing like that until uh, I was kicking it with FB. I used to kick with that nigga every day. Just every day. We had a studio together, all types of shit. And, uh, but I already knew Frosty. He didn't know them niggas and shit. So I invited that nigga to... Uh, Frosty, I was like, pull up. So you can meet my little brother. I used to call him my little brother and shit. Pull up. Uh, I'm gonna make beats for you and shit. The nigga, I'm be like, that nigga made beats for uh, Blueface. I'm gonna go, oh yeah, he did. All right, pull up, right? So he pulled up. 
he was making hella beats, and then he showed him a gang of beats, and Frosty would just look at me, and I'd be like, nah, not that beat. Feel me? Mm. That's my, I was, that was like my little brother. I should have been like, yeah, that beat. But I was like, nah, I gotta be hard for you and him. I'm, I'm about to just tell, for, hey, get on this beat. This, nah, this beat is weak, bro. Come mm. on, bro. Keep, you got, you got hella beats. We're gonna find one. Come on. Kept playing them. Kept, he didn't like nothing. Well, I didn't like nothing. But he would look at me. You feel me? Like, I'd be like, nah. He made a gang of beats. He didn't like him either. And he's like, fuck it, blood. He was like, fuck it, blood. Y'all keep making beats. Or keep making beats. FB. I'm going to come back some other day. Shit, we're going to make a song, though. So that nigga left and shit. Then FB got up, went to the bathroom. He was like, I'm going I'm, I'm, I'm to fuck with your computer. Because he showed me a little bit how to make beats and shit. So I'm going to with your computer trying to make a beat. He's like, all right. So I pulled up, started making the beat and shit. That nigga Frosty pulls back up because he forgot his weed or some shit. So he was like, damn, this be hard, KP. Who made this shit? You made this shit? I'm like, yeah. He was like, yeah, that shit hard. He was already right. He started rapping and shit. He was like, add the 808s. Add the 808s. Added the 808s. He was like, he started rapping. I'm like, he's like, I'm finna rap on this shit right now, could he? I'm like, what? He's like, hell yeah. He's like, you don't got no more beats? I'm like, nah, this is like my first beat. <laughs> damn, <laughs> so I'm gonna say, I'm like, damn, this nigga. So he got on the song and shit. He did the song, and me and FB, um, I let him get on the on the beat too. Like he came back, he, I'm like that nigga like this beat, bro. And I looked at him, I'm like, guess I'm a producer now, nigga. Like, Dead homies now. <laughs> we'll make some beats now because he, he wants more beats. I'm like, I might do a tape with this nigga. You know, you feel me? I'm like, I need a I need a name though. I was like, I need a name because I'm not gonna use KP the producer. You feel me? It gotta be something hard. You feel me? So. I just thought about working hard, you feel me? I'm Hispanic and shit, so I feel like our community, you feel me? Like, everybody got their, like, what's it called, uh, stigmatisms or, or whatever, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. Like, they think about the stereotypes. The stereotypes. The stereotypes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The stereotypes. <laughs> so when they think about us, they think about us as, a lot of them, we have that hard worker. All the Mexicans are hard workers. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, I like walk. So I was like, walk harder. Mm. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> simple as that. Simple as that. I'm like walk harder, day hobbies. And then um then my homie TNT made the tag. And the tag was like this be walk hard, no cap. And then the other one was um walk harder, they about to be fanned out. So then the niggas just started making bees. I got a couple of songs with Frosty. You dropped like two or three of them. You feel that's me? dope. Yeah, but that's the only reason why I made beats because I nigga wanted beats and shit, you feel me? And and I thought I yeah, I'm like that could open doors for me to meet more rappers and Facts. maybe I could, you know what I'm saying? That's the way I could get my rapping in there. You feel me? But then I got locked up and all that shit happened. And, and now I'm over there, which I don't got too much networking mobility. You feel me? Because, I mean, there's an EBK Jable out there and there's like the EBK niggas and shit. You feel me? But I don't really know them niggas like that. Like, you feel me? Like what I'm saying? I still got to go... I've been been there for hella long. You feel me? All, all my homies, I, I don't even talk to them niggas no more. I only talk to like one nigga. So I'm my nigga KRS from Glock Team. So I Glock Team in the Southeast. They help me. So I go, oh, shout out KB. <laughs> shout out them niggas though. But you ever heard of Glock Team? Them niggas be, uh, no, I'm, he, they be going to a lot of those smoke places and they're really known and shit. So shout out them niggas. Them niggas is doing this shit. But um, yeah, bro. I mean, I don't know what the you asked me. I just. No, nah, you did out. your thing. <laughs> Is there anything you want to leave the people with before we clock out? Yeah, man. Uh, yeah, bro. This is this shit takes a lot of hard work, bro. It don't it don't facts. So just you know, I'm not where I'm at, where I want to be. But I'll tell you what, like before I got like that, I almost had 20k followers, and they deleted it because I used to post a bunch of bullshit. You feel me? <laughs> But I learned from my mistake, but I already knew the marketing way. So now that I'm out, I went from 2,000 to 1,000, no, 10,000 followers in less than four months. You feel me? But it, it, it ain't free, though. Remember that, though, Cuddy. You know what I'm saying? But if you know you got what it takes or people would like to see you on the internet, hey, 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 just, you know what I mean? You make a side hustle or whatever. Or, or I don't lie, I don't like working, but you got to sacrifice a little bit to to be where you want to be at. You feel me? So absolutely. Even uh, even when you go commit crimes and shit, or you go rob niggas, you're still you feel me going out of your way to do it. So it, it took something to get it. You feel me? So niggas go invest their money or whatever. They know you know what I'm saying, like that with work or whatever the fuck. But it takes money. You feel me? And and it ain't easy. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? Like that's why I don't, I don't really make content. I just like, if it's a funny moment, I record it and it'll be good content. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But I'm not out here trying to like, or if I think of something, all oh, these bitches or, or what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like I'll say it and it does good. I guess you feel me? 
But that's pretty much it, though. Shout out to Food Community and, and you, yeah, all right? <laughs> <laughs> Highly appreciate you for yeah. popping out. You're a sick ass fool. And yeah, go make your purchases and shit. Joints only. Yeah, just give me your uh, size and I'm gonna get you one, bro, because you definitely Back. need joint. Feel me? And, and you already know who brought this shit back, bro. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, you know what I'm saying, though? Oh, man. That's right. Yeah, bro, you got to have one of these, bro. You don't got one. I don't know if you a joint, bro. No. <laughs> I don't know, Cuddy, you feel me? But, yeah. Shout out to KP, the finesse, a.k. Walk Carter in the fucking spot. On the boards, as usual, the owner, creator of the full community, Rich Homie Juan. And as you know, I am LA Icon. Yeah. Shout out to all you sick ass fools right out of here. This fool. This fool.